Around 2005, um, life couldn't have been much better for me. I had met the woman of my dreams, my wife, Michelle. Business was incredible. My construction company was going through the roof. We had uh, just about anything you could want, four homes, uh, any car we wanted to drive. All our kids are in private school. Life was really, really good. And I started really feeling like we needed to go back to church. I was a little reluctant. Um, I, I was raised in a, in, in a church home and uh, kind of walked away from God for about 25 years. Really wanted nothing to do with Him. But figured, you know, if we could go, you know, once every six months, we'd be good. I think through a flyer through South Hills, we, I got my husband to go. The next thing I know, I'm raising my hand to rededicate my life, and I'm pretty sure the shock and dismay on my wife's face or my children's face, if that could have been recorded, probably would have been pretty good. The Lord asked me a question that day, and he said, Kevin, are you sure this time? Are you really sure that you're willing to follow me? And I said, yes, Lord, I am. Within about six months of rededicating my life, the absolute bottom fell out. We had basically lost everything. You know, being a man that has always wanted to take care of his family, and finding that everything you've known in life to do isn't available for you anymore. And I'm thinking to myself, wow, I give you my life, Lord, and, and everything's gone. You're trying to figure out how to keep your kids in school. You're trying to figure out how to keep the lights on, where you're gonna live and what you're gonna do. It didn't seem like there was any way out at all. It was at that point that I made a, a decision that I wanted to tithe, and tithing was the only place that I knew that I could test God. I just, I clinged to the promises that were here in the Word of God. And I just literally walked out on faith and believed in my heart that if I did what God asked me to do, the one thing I couldn't screw up, tithing, that He was going to deliver me from this horrible mess I was in. So what my wife and I started doing was, every Sunday, she writes out the check, she puts it in the envelope, I put my hand on her knee. And I put my hand on his. We'd pray over it. And we wrap that tithe up in absolute expectation that God is going to bless us. It wasn't always easy. My wife and I went without a lot. But every one of our needs were always met. Four and a half years later, I, I can't even be begin to tell you how much God has blessed us. Everything that was taken from us has been given back. So we were just blessed beyond belief. And I, I, I have to believe in my heart that it's because of our obedience to God. Did it happen overnight? No. It's a process. Commit to the process. The results will follow.